So these are blue-eyed knights. These dudes don't fuck about. Ah! No, please! No. <laughs> right, so I'm going to try and lure him to do an attack and then follow up. At yeah, there we go. A pokey pokey mcpokey tins. And some enemies can actually heal themselves if you give them the chance. Some enemies like to, like, you know, go to their local drugstore and buy themselves some weed. And numb on that when they're feeling down in the dumps. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, wait, he has a shield up, doesn't he? No! Attack me! Attack me, you knave! You peasant, I'm royalty. Oh! <laughs> I apologize. <laughs> so with two-handed attacks, you can um, break their guard uh, relatively easily. But with piercing weapons, I don't think it happens too well. <laughs> Stop! <just> die! <laughs> Please. Or you could try and go. If you had a shield, you could um, try and do what's called a repost, which is where you kind of like do this like smack attack. Uh, where you inter intercept their attack with your shield, and then uh, that kind of opens them up to a critical attack, which is like equivalent to a backstab, I think. I don't know if it does more damage than a backstab, I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure it does, because it I think it takes quite a bit more skill to pull that shit off. Because <laughs> if it doesn't go wrong, if it goes wrong, your head comes off, which sucks. No! Fucking knave! Royalty, so creepy. All up in this pancake mix. Right, so we've almost done this. Uh... Oh my days! I'm being careless as fuck. <laughs> oh, foreshadowing the future <laughs> of this walkthrough. <laughs> it's just gonna be a load of like cut editing, cutting the video of me just getting a compilation of me just getting like anally eviscerated. Oh, I can only imagine. So yeah, we're pretty much at the end of this tutorial zone now. <laughs> I missed! Fuck! <laughs> <sighs> See, I think the uh, ending is, yeah, just ride these stairs. So when, um, when you come to these uh, big ass, like, looking foggy areas like this, looking like someone's been smoking a shitload of that weed, um, <laughs> been to burn up too much crescent moon grass, uh, this is, you can see right through here, you can see them glowy ass eyes, yeah, that's a big motherfucking bows. So it's, in, it's implied here that you get killed. <laughs> ah! <laughs> yeah, like that. <laughs> I have actually killed him once, but that was with the soul arrow, you just, I just stood there go, no! <laughs> Spam my magic like a little bitch, get that Harry Potter shit out of here. Oh! So yeah, we got, uh, but blasted <laughs> by some big fat demon. And, uh... That throws us into this nice place called the Nexus. It's just a, uh, it's just safe zone basically, and it has this really nice music. It's nice and tranquil and shit, man. And everyone's practically nice, except for this old dude that likes to repair your shit. He just talks shit to you all the time and then takes your money. I don't like him. But he upgrades my my weapon, so I need that. So yeah, we are gonna allow ourselves to upgrade our, our weapons and um, wear uh, things like rings and stuff, but we're not really gonna be changing our armor much, if anything. Yeah, pancake face. So the world might be mended. I don't know really what happened to her face. I don't know, I don't know whether she like really likes candles and like got too close to some and she got like some fucking hot wax on her face, but if you take a look, good look at her, she got some horrible ass burn marks, man. This is the Nexus. It holds together the northern land of Boletaria. <laughs> Them tits! Thou canst not exit the Nexus, but each of the five arch stones will connect them to the Boletaria. So the Nexus is like our, um... I guess it's our, like, uh, HQ kind of thing. It's, um... Kind of like where we go to prepare for where we've got to go next. So you have died! You really suck at this game. And the Nexus has trapped your soul. You cannot escape the Nexus. You're fucked. <laughs> Great! <laughs> However, by capturing demon souls, you, you can reclaim your physical body. That's great! I got a ring! Okay, so we're not going to be using our body. We're, uh, basically, if you have a look at our health here, now that we've died, we've gone into spirit form. And in spirit form, our HP is halved. Like, our max HP has now gone to half. So, uh, we're, like, even more vulnerable now, which really smokes dicks. 
there's a blood stain here. So um, basically, the, this game is like constantly like interacting with the online world. Uh, you can get messages from people, and you can also get their blood stains. So this is where actually people have died in the game, actual players, and you get to see how they die by touching their blood. So what's he? What what the fuck is he doing here? <laughs> Who is he attacking? <laughs> oh, he must have pissed off someone. Cause you don't, you don't normally fight in the Nexus at all, unless you're doing like some side quests. Like these are all nice people. Some like have attitudes and shit, but they don't raise their fists at you or anything. Oh yeah, and you also see these ghosts. These are actual players like running around and shit. So yeah, <laughs> by smearing your face in the blood and playing with their fucking with their juices, you get to see how they die. <laughs> it's a fucked up game. All right, so this is um basically where you've got to go first. This is World One, the Boletaria Palace. A huge stone castle in the heart of the northern kingdom of Boletaria. Hungry soldiers whose souls have been stolen by demon attacks and trespasses. And terrible dragons nest here. Oh lord. <laughs> so this is one of my favorite areas. Boletaria Palace is so well made. It's such a nice place. Well, save from the whole, you know, it's been pillaged and everyone wants to like rip your face off and stuff. It's a really nice looking place. I guess the best way to summon demon souls is kind of like a huge... Open dungeon crawl, I suppose. It's really fucking fun. <laughs> Man, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm actually scared. <laughs> oh, lord. This is pretty. Oh god! Hey, welcome to Demon Souls, motherfucker! I got a mouthful of bodies! <laughs> You're next! <laughs> and he's not even the boss, he's a sub boss. Okay, so this is where we start off, and these are messages left by players. There's Treasure Head! You can summon here. That's great, but we're not going to be summoning. We're not, uh, by summoning, you get other people to join your world, and they can help you with a boss if you're stuck. Late Moongrass, nom nom. That shit makes you fucking f start stroking walls and stuff, man. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, so. Oh god! Ah! Oh, I did not see. Ah! Oh, fuck! Demon Souls! <laughs> Why? <laughs> yeah, I gotta get my head in the game, man. What the fuck did I just do? <laughs> They're like a stab in a hot bag, like, no, get back, you knave. <laughs> Alright, so, these are like, these are called dreglings, I think. These are like your pretty much, like, bullshit enemy. <clears throat> but when they're in numbers, they can get pretty fucking mean. But the great thing about this game is no matter how, uh, how leveled you are or how experienced you are, if you don't take anything, like, seriously, if you really underestimate your opponent, regardless of how, like, you know, early on in the game, it's gonna pretty much like rip your face off. Ow! <laughs> Man, come on, I don't wanna die just yet. <laughs> At least let me do phalanx without dying. <laughs> no! So, yeah, when you backstab, you have this like short invincibility frame where, uh, in the animation where nothing can touch you. Yay! <laughs> Seven spines for everyone. Slave shield. Alright. Let's get this shit started. There's another blood stain there. See, this dude just got ripped up here. Clearly. Ah! Stop your crazy ass raven. Woo! So yeah, I really don't. I really don't like this kind of weapon at all. I'm not a big fan of like pokey pokey like needle weapons. I'm not. I'm not too hot on that shit. So um, I'm pretty eager to get my mittens on another weapon. Come on, smack the wood. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck this wood. All right, awesome. No! So creepy has that evasive skills. <laughs> so, you notice here, every time we get a kill, we're getting this, in the bottom right, we're getting this kind of like, um, this currency, this number going up. Now, that's just souls. Now, souls pretty much make the whole world go around in this twisted place. It levels you up, it uh, repairs your gear, it upgrades your gear, it, uh, buys stuff from, like, uh, stores and shit. Does everything. And when you die, you lose those souls. That sucks. But considering we're not gonna level up anyway, <laughs> souls are pretty much useless to us. Get in the fucking pit of souls, you knave! <laughs> you 
can try and fucking arch me. How dare you? I'm a lady. No! <laughs> Why did I do that? <laughs> Stop a fight midway just to pick up an item. Pit trap. Yeah, see if I can push him in there. Get in there. Get in there. Uh, uh, please don't throw me in. Ah, no! <laughs> Get in the pit of souls. <laughs> you shall be cleansed. Ah! For your sins. There we go. <laughs> oh, I want to see how you did. Don't tell me you fell into the pit. He's going to fall into the pit, isn't he? <laughs> What's he doing? Oh, no. He just got clubbed. Oh, man. What was that? He had like two dildos in his hands or something. No wonder he got fucked up. Yeah, I knew, I knew that was coming. <laughs> Cheeky son of a bitch. You get that, you get that lot in this game. Like, people, like, hiding behind, like, walls and shit and ready to, like, cut your spleen out. Nasty fucking whore tactics. Your mother was a whore, and you're a whore. So was your father. There's a one-way road ahead. <laughs> oh, yeah, so you can write your own uh, messages and stuff. There's a bed here. All right, check it out. Write a message. Uh, maybe we should just say, no, no, no. <laughs> oh, please, I can, if it's in here. Oh, I don't think it's going to be. Damn it, it's not here. Ah, bollocks. <laughs> I want to just write something. Hold on. Aw, oh, man, I was gonna put sticky white stuff down there. <laughs> yeah, there's this item that you can use called sticky white stuff, I know. <laughs> this is fucking terrible. <laughs> you can coat your blade in it. It's disgusting. It does extra damage. What happened to you? Oh. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I think there's bad... Yeah, there's baddies on the other side as well. Okay! <laughs> That's what fucked up George. His name was George. Okay, you down. No! I won't succumb to your his fate. Alright, so far so good. So far- <laughs> He was attached to my hip. Oh, these physics. Alright, so even though we're not gonna use it, pretty much any of the shit that we're gonna pick up, I like it- I like adventuring anyway. Get a mail breaker here? Yeah. I've never used that weapon. Ever. Not a big fan of daggers. Oh shit, he likes to throw fucking fire on us. We're hot enough as it is, man. <laughs> oh shit. Ah, oh, no! It's fucking flame blade. Ah! Get the hell out of here. I'm trying to scorch my ass. Singe my bum hairs. <laughs> You done fucked up! Oh, we're doing so we're doing good so far, yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> ah! He's throwing more. Okay. No. I saw another one there. Oh, what happened to you? I want to see this. <laughs> Grab the popcorn. Oh lord. Oh, he got burnt. You threw. Oh, man. <laughs> he got burnt. Poor dude. Ah, so did I. Shit. 